Hello. Hi. And welcome back to Cooking Wave 101. Yes, it is our third episode. Yes, third it episode is our third this episode. season. Mm -hmm. And it's Halloween soon, not really in like what week? Mm -hmm. A week or yeah, so. Yeah, about a week. So about a week ago. Oh, no. <laughs> Um, but yes, yeah, so we're making a more fall-themed dish today. We're making Apple Betty, which let's show. Are you good? Classic Apple Betty. Classic Apple Betty. So it's not the caramel apples. Whoops, there we go. It's this one. Can't have my caramel apples, am I right? So, yeah, I already cored and peeled the apples. Oh, she cored the and apples, sliced honey. Them. Hello. Our set's decorated for Halloween, by the way. Yeah, it looks, it looks good. Thank you, uh, Daniel. I'm going to move so they can see. Oh, I'm sorry. Elvis is joining us as well. Yes. Nice um, Elvis Presley dish. Thank hello. you, Canada, our Canada, chief engineer, hello. for giving us the apples. Oh, yeah, thanks for your thanks apples, for that. Canada. We have a nice uh, collection of Granny Smith. Uh, I think there's a Red Delicious and then a Gala apple. A Red Delicious. Yeah. Deal so. Delicious. So the first thing we have to do for this is we need to grease. Grease her. Grease her up. Grease it up. So my favorite way to do that is with butter. <laughs> because there's one thing I've learned. What are your from, thoughts on Mike Tyson, Melissa? I don't really have a lot of thoughts on Mike Tyson. It's oh. not really something I think about. Oh, I think about Mike Tyson every night before I go to bed. Really? No, mm -hmm. I would not be surprised. I just like to think about his career and how he bit off that guy's ear and everything. Good time. So you're gonna take the butter, grease like it, it, using it, and there we just go. Uh, shove it in. Not shove oh. it. <laughs> Put it in the pan and <laughs> grease it. I'm gonna stop. I'm I quaking. Am I'm a quaker and a shaker. Mentally not here today. I'm doing a craft today, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Thank yep. you. Some of our crew's excited about my craft. I think I've gotten a general consensus. Everyone's pretty much excited about the craft. Um, it's going to be with don't popsicle Don't make sticks a today. mess. That's the only thing. OK, so this is surface. You can't really see that well, but it's greased very, very well. Where'd my scissors go? Oh, here they are. So. What I'm making today, the surprise craft. Melissa, do you want to guess what my surprise craft today is? Are you making a house? Oh, God. A oh. pumpkin? I don't know. A pumpkin? I don't know. It's Halloween. I'm not advanced enough for a pumpkin. Um, any other guesses? It has to do with, like... <laughs> do you need a better, like, cutting utensil? Because I have a knife that would work a lot better than those scissors. No, I like um, dull take that instruments. <laughs> Okay, so the next thing you have to do with this dish is you need to take the four to five peeled and cored apples. You know, and I don't think them. we're gonna cut it. It's gonna take too long. I'm not doing it. It's not happening. You do that. I'm gonna arrange the apples all nice like. I feel like is this? Hold on, I need those scissors. Where did I put the scissors? I don't know where you put them. Oh, I love the smell of apples. It does smell really good in here. Hold on, you like really can't see it on camera, so I'm just gonna what cut this doing? lip off the um. If you don't want your apples to go brown like this, you put uh lemon juice on them and that will keep them. Uh, I didn't really care because one, I don't have a lot of lemon juice on me to do that. And two, they're just going to be cooked. So they're going to get browned anyway because mm -hmm. we're using brown sugar. What are your thoughts on bookcases, Melissa? I love bookcases. Yeah? Yeah, we have uh, a library room in my house. Oh. Because we just Isn't have... Is that like a secret library door? No, it doesn't. Sad. But it has a giant bookcase that spans the wall that oh, we keep cool. a handful of our books on. A handful? We have a lot of books. So what I'm doing is I'm taking three um, popsicle sticks and I'm going to make a base. Oh, did I even reveal what the craft was? No, you didn't. Do you have any more guesses? Uh, a hat? I don't know. Okay, these ones are like kind of like... I feel like I'm thinking of two advanced things. <laughs> I could make a hat out of popsicle sticks. That'd be easy. Like a, a witch's hat? Like for Halloween? I feel like... That I, would take I, like really long though. Yeah, but dedication, am I right? Am I right? Shannon, do you have any guesses about what my craft is? Um, no, I have no idea. This is a lot of apples. So I'm making a mug. A mug? Mm-hmm. Um, I'm making a base first. I'm going to create a base. This feels like the kind of thing that a kid would do for like their dad in like kindergarten. Well, maybe I am doing it for my dad, and maybe I that am in kindergarten. Sweet. So. I know. I always knew it. Kindergarten was a time. 
One time this girl was convinced I was cheating off her, um, was convinced I was cheating off of her, um, assignment, and I wasn't. Can I was just say, rude. speaking, so, I had my a midterm this morning, mm -hmm. and I have, you know, my hair hanging down like this, and my professor thought I had headphones in, so she was like, Melissa, and I was staring at her, I'm like, what are you talking about? I don't understand. And then she, like, came closer, she's like, headphones, you have to take them out, and I'm like, what headphones? Because it was my hair. Oh. And I'm pretty sure a girl in my class like went up and told her that I had headphones in because as soon as this girl went up and like talked to her, it was when my professor started like pointing at me. <laughs> and I was really confused. So Is it gonna be a square mug? Maybe. Don't try and This is a lot of apples. Don't try and Oh no. Oh, this is gonna... Did you look ahead at all how to make something? No. Okay. I'm just doing it live. <laughs> I think that like the best creations, first of all, I'm not trying to imitate anyone. How dare you? Second of all, um, uh, I think just like some of our best work comes from just spontaneity, you know? Sounds like a whole art theory. It because really it is. is. It is an art theory. There well, is no true art. Oh my god, those kind of looks like those kind of look like Lay's potato chips. I'm kind of into that. It's because they browned. Oh. Well. Hello. Oh, she's eating them. Everyone, did you wash your hands? Mm -hmm. With really hot water, because we have a water oh, yeah. crisis here in Fredonia. We're we'll talking about this water crisis. Day three, no water. Already had to boil my toothbrush. I stuck it in the sink I'm like an absent-minded fool. How dare you? I've just been brushing my teeth with like bottles of Poland spray. We boiled water at my house, so we like have some of that in the fridge. I think my microwave just actually might catch on fire in my dorm if I tried to boil water. <laughs> my fridge makes a lot of noise in the night. It's like, oh! that's what it's like. Okay, so these are our apples, all nicely put together. So then what we do now. Gotta make it work, gotta, gotta make it work. Oh is no. Okay. We take lemon juice, uh -huh. which I have in this Tupperware <laughs> container. As you can see, the mug is coming together. I'm building a wall for it. Is it? Oh my god. So maybe I'll take this part off, and then now that I have it marked where I want to cut. We're actually going to do the two tablespoons of sugar first. <laughs> this is about how my semester is going, if you're wondering. Where's that knife you said you had? It's in the green room, okay. so I don't maybe actually have Maybe we can have, have someone here. grab that from the green room real quick. I'm talking to you, Magic Joe. Joe, hello. You want to sprinkle Thank sugar you. on top. I'm actually really excited for this. Are you? Yes. That's fun. Ugh. Oh my, can I sprinkle some sugar on there? I'm almost done. <gasps> Do you want to put the lemon juice on it? Uh, duh. Okay. I love lemon juice. I use it as a moisturizer. I don't think that would be I do, it helps a lot. Is it? I don't know, I feel like that would be Thank too you, acidic. Like, I know milk is Hey, really everyone, good guess what we have Be now. very careful with that knife. I already took it out of its container earlier. Okay, just be very careful. <laughs> <laughs> Got that from my grandmother's house. Oh. A fun story. Good stuff. Yeah. It's a great story. Do you want to do What's the... What's the story? That's it, that's all it is. It's not really a story. Do you want to do the lemon juice? or you Yeah, of course. To? Would you like to try and cut this in half while I'm doing the lemon juice? Here, switch. Just two tablespoons. Oh, this smells good. It's lemon juice. Um, let's see. What do you want? A tablespoon? Two tablespoons. So the one that's covered in the sugar. Um, do you have any um, poetry? Nope. That you'd like to read? Nope. I don't share my poetry. Oh, a secret poet she is. I'm not really that good, so kind of stay away from it. Did you put two in? Yeah. You did? All right. Mm -hmm. This wasn't like the most, um, not the best container. Thank you. I appreciate I it. I know it's not the best. It was all I had, though, so. Melissa, I got you a collar. It's all in the season. Very avant-garde. Very avant-garde. I'm applying for Project Runway. I would vote. I think you'd, although I feel like it would look better 
Oh my god, what happened? Oh my god. Okay, so Somebody is foiling my craft. I'm upset. <laughs> You're doing that yourself. I need this bolt. Oh, it's time to reload the glue gun, everyone. You always want to make sure you have a loaded glue gun. I want to shout out to, um, um, I just would like to uh, shout out to Jay's mother. She's uh, watching, I think, hopefully. Um, she's a very nice lady. I've only talked to her a few times. I'd love to meet her more, but maybe we'll get lunch someday. We should invite her on the show. She wants to come. I won't stop her. Oh my god, literally, she's on her way right now. I can hear her car turning up. So we need half a cup of old-fashioned oats. What if I am a or progressive oat? Oats. What? I don't think that it does not exist. Are you part of the oats tea party? <laughs> Dead silence. <laughs> I'm sorry. What's your favorite kind of tea, Melissa? Ooh. Mine's the type you can spill. <laughs> I just, I really like tea. Do you? I do. There's this one tea that I really like from Adagio. It's called Sherlock from the BBC Sherlock. And it, it's a smoky tea and it's a black tea and it's really good. I just really love tea. Like I have so much tea at home. It's a lot. I okay. Need tea, am I right, ladies? You need two thirds a cup of brown sugar. Oh, this is going to take a while. Your cup, probably. This brown sugar, you need to be very careful when storing brown sugar. You need to make sure all the air is kept out of it when you close it up. I like to keep my brown sugar up. wide out in the open, especially for a bite from someone. Mm -mm. <laughs> Don't do that. You will ruin the brown sugar. It will go hard. And you'll ruin relationships. What? What? Who? I don't know her. Maybe I'll just, like, maybe I, I feel like cutting these are going to take really long, so I'm just not going to cut them. That's the new plan. Do you need any hot glue in there, Melissa? No. Okay. You want to pat down the brown pat sugar, pat too. Pat pat oh, no, I did this too long. Uh-oh. SpaghettiOs. Retro. Am I all right? So there we go. Two-thirds a cup of brown sugar. Can't wait to drink out of this. I should sell these. I'll be tabling in McEwen Hall from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. tomorrow, selling my cups. Um, Make yes, sure you really tighten fair, it. But I'm a big maker, so don't assume the size of my making. Um, that was kind of rude, Janet. Thank you. Um, so how have you been lately, Melissa? I've been OK. Nothing really exciting has happened in my life. Well, that's a little bit of a lie. I was oh, offered a paper. research assistant position with my art history professor. Uh, researching my grandmother's cousin. She was an art artist post World War II. Mm -hmm. Came to America and oh, did contemporary <laughs> art, and she was a female. Oh, so, that's cool. Yeah, that's really exciting, and I really hope it works out. So, do you get like credit for that? Mm -hmm. I'd get one to two credits, and I could put it towards my minor in art history. Good. Okay, so we have the brown sugar, the oats, and then we need one teaspoon of cinnamon and one teaspoon of nutmeg. So we have both I'm sorry, of those what things. mag? Nutmeg. Oh, okay. Did you see the witch in Tim Hortons today? I saw it on your story. Oh, she was there. I don't know if that was like leftover from like alumni weekend or what. But Maybe. She was in the middle of, and I'm surprised nobody has popped. Speaking of alumni weekend, you did a very good job with the station. Thank you. We cleaned her, Melissa. I know. It was really nice. Just shout Thank out you. to the uh, alum who came. Thanks yeah. for coming. Yeah. We had a good turnout. Yeah. It was really cool to like meet them. Definitely. A lot of WNYFers. Okay. So now we need a third a cup of butter. This cup's going to be airtight. I, I hope it is. Can't wait to drink some polluted water out of it later. So this is about a third a cup of butter, which is one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> this might be a this might be a to a be continued craft into the next episode. I feel like you should have come in with a little more of a game plan plan. Oh no, I would never. Are you kidding me? Mm -mm. No game plan here, honey. I didn't even eat dinner today. Didn't either. And then you need to cut in the butter, and since we don't have a fork. 
I'm going to use a knife to cut it in, but this is what the mixture looks like cut so far. In. How do you cut in? Oh, you just cut it in half? No. You're supposed to have, like, this thing that... I don't even know how to describe it. Like, a fork usually works better, but I don't mm -hmm. have a fork. Because I didn't plan ahead completely. Interesting. It's a lot going on. Well... That's, that's a time, and what a time to be alive. Mm-hmm. How have you been doing, Patrick? Oh, I'm fine. I kind of have to pee, but like other than well, that. Well, we're going to be coming to a commercial soon. So very shortly. Run in and do that then. Maybe I'll just hold it to keep the intensity up on this craft building project. Oh, no! She fell. OK, maybe I'll start building the other wall as a support. I think that's a good plan. So, so as you can see, the wall's going up on my, oh, OK, never mind. Um, the wall was going up on my mug, and we'll find out how much progress I make during the next commercial break. Yeah. All right. Bye. We'll be back in just a minute, guys. See you soon. They'll test you. Try to break your will. But however loud the loudness gets, however many cheese puffs may fly, you're the driver, the one in control. Stand firm. Just wait. And move only when you hear the click that says they're buckled in for the drive. Never give up till they buckle up. Party fouls are pretty dumb. But if you decide to drink and drive underage, you could lose your license and your freedom. Underage drinking and driving. The ultimate party foul. Guess what? I have some news for you. There's free food right there. Junk food. You see that truck? Oh, jeez. It's a two Michelin star chef. All for free, ladies and gentlemen. All for free. Here we have a panzanella with summer vegetables and pesto. Enjoy. Okay. How we doing? Fantastic. So what do you got going on underneath that plate there? This food is really about to be thrown away. Yeah. Bro? Is there, is there something wrong with this food? Where did you get it from? From farmer's markets. They put aside the ugly vegetables and the ugly fruits. Yeah. Carrot top, soft avocados. It was all food that was going to be discarded. Even the drink you had is made from like a little bruised peach. Did it taste a little it's bruised? Like great. It's good. The average person throws away 24 pounds of food a month. That's a lot. Isn't that a lot? Go visit savethefood.com for more information. Thank you. Junk food time! But you are exactly what I'm looking for. Your company could be missing out on the candidates it needs most. Learn how to find, cultivate, and train a great pool of untapped talent at gradsoflife.org. I realized that I'm not perfect, but it all really started to change because you judge me for having a problem. No one is going to know that I need help. I need help. I know that no one is going to judge me for having a problem. I realize that I'm not perfect, but it all really started to change because you listen. I guess sometimes things just happen. Devastating things. It's got nothing to do with fairness. changes in an instant and you never see it coming that's what happened to me the day my mother had a stroke i'm paul george and i want you to learn the signs of a stroke fast f-a-s-t f face drooping 
A. Arm weakness. S. Speech difficulty. T. Time to call 911. Because the sooner they get to the hospital, the sooner they'll get treatment. And that can make a remarkable difference in their recovery. Protect the ones you love. Spot a stroke. F A S T. Fast. Guess what? I have some news for you. There's free food right there. Junk food. You see that truck? Oh, jeez. It's a two Michelin star chef. All for free, ladies and gentlemen. All for free. Here we have a panzanella with summer vegetables and pesto. Enjoy. Okay. How we doing? Fantastic. So what do you got going on underneath that plate there? This food is really about to be thrown away. Yeah. Really? Is there, is there something wrong with this food? Where did you get it from? From farmer's markets. They put aside the ugly vegetables and the ugly fruits. Yeah. Carrot top, soft avocados. It was all food that was going to be discarded. Even the drink you had is made from like a little bruised peach. Did it taste it's a little like bruised? Great. It was good. The average person throws away 24 pounds of food a month. That's a lot. Isn't that a lot? Go visit savethefood.com for more information. Thank you. Junk food time. Welcome back to Cooking Wave 101. We're doing it here. We're doing it live. Um, the walls are going up on my uh, on my mug. mug. Uh, it's happening. I'm so, going to uh, put yeah. our crumble mixture on top. Oh, crumble, crumble, honey. Do you need some help? Um, honestly, not. Put the yarn away, Patrick. 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 <laughs> uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay. I think so. I have yarn now for this craft. And I think I'm going to make it so you can wear the mug around your neck. <laughs> so tell me a little bit more about this crumble, Melissa. Were you paying attention when I made it? So just to recap, it's butter, it's nutmeg, cinnamon, uh -huh. brown sugar, okay. and oats. Good. And we just want to put this on top. Put it on top. Will you always put me on top, Melissa? Oh, I, I'm not sure. Will I always be your number one? Yes. Sure. She's like, no. I'm like, whatever makes you happy. She's like, never. Oh, Lord. OK, this wall definitely is a lot more waterproof than this You're one. You're my this number one, one co-host. This one was definitely, I'm your only co-host. Um, <laughs> this one, I don't think I'm going to be able to um, get it off this, but it's a fine. It's fine. We can just cut around it. Um, yeah, it'll like be a little bottom. Yeah, it's fine. Some apple bottom jeans, boots with the fur. That's as much as I can sing He's before T Pain world. sues okay. us. <laughs> Will so. he? The odds of them finding this. Honestly, odds. <laughs> odds we get flagged for copyright. <laughs> okay, uh, then we just have to cover it up and pop her in the micro. I just want to shout out to Hemingway Hall for letting me borrow their um, glue gun. Thanks, uh, everyone there. Amara included, the RD. Love you, girl. I would also like to shout out to Jen Seavers and the rest of the Seavers family for watching, and Ali, because you guys are great, and I can't wait to meet you this weekend. We're going to go to the hibachi. I love hibachi. Me too. Japanese food in general is mm -hmm. something I very much enjoy. So this goes in for 20 minutes. But we're going to do intervals of five, because the last time we put something in for the full length it told us to, we burnt it. Mm -hmm. R.I.P. the croutons. Yeah. Oh, Lord. So anyone have some fun facts about, uh, let's, uh, I'm going to go ahead and call the control room real quick. What's the number again? Three, 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 three. That's three. UP, but sure. Okay, I was told to try and make a craft too. Control so room. This is gonna be an adventure. Um, if you could just quick do a quick fact check and look up some facts about hot glue guns and get back to me in my ear, that'd be great. Thank you. About what? About okay. hot glue guns. Hello, I'm okay, thank you. This. Okay. All right. Bye bye. <laughs> they were angry. I hung up in the control room. Are they? Yes. 
I'm gonna borrow. <laughs> we're gonna. It's craft night, I guess. Craft, craft, Mer. Happy holidays, Merry Craftmas. We should do a Christmas special. Live, laugh, craft. Am I right, ladies and gentlemen, and whoever? I feel like Martha Stewart. You know. Marty, old Marty oh, Stew. I love Marty's my, stew. My base. It's my favorite kind of stew. Other than beef stew, of course. I love a good beef stew. <laughs> so, We have Jason behind us. I wonder if I could just use a glue stick. Yeah, it's Hall Halloween, kids. We can oh, Lord! Spooky. Actually, if you're not using this, I will. What? <laughs> no. It doesn't fit over my glasses. Everything fits over my glasses. Hello? I'm just going to ignore you for a little bit. I <laughs> am sure you're perfectly capable of whatever you're doing right now. Daniel is quaking in his boots that I just tore apart this set. Oh, no. He worked. He did a really good job on that set. Oh, I fixed it. I fixed it. You know, I'll be back. Here you go. Where are you going? OK, well, I'm going to try and build a house. I guess that's what I'm going to try and do. I'm not really sure. I'm just going. You're going to build a house? Yeah, or maybe a... I'm building a home! <laughs> or maybe it could be a picture frame. Now, this puts us at more of a level height when I sit. I believe in standing. Well, it's hard when you're crafting. You start to work up a sweat. When you're an art student. Melissa, well, so when do you standing. think glue guns were invented? Glue guns? Probably mm -hmm. the ninth. 1980s, 70s, maybe? That would be my guess. That's Shannon, any guesses? Oh, yes, you are correct. It's 1950. I forgot she has a headset. <laughs> are you sure? It is 1954. Yeah. That's kind of close. Um, do you know who it's by? Who invented it? Probably like Fisher Price or something. Um, it's the name of one of the residence halls in this. Hemingway. At this, no. at this institution of learning and living. Oh, I'm gonna owe oh, Hemingway Hall some hot glue gun sticks. Eisen Disney? No, I don't know. Schultz. Schultz. He's a pastor from Alabama. This this all could be fake news, so just don't. Ooh, that smells good. Do you smell that? I just smell burning hot glue and burning flesh oh. from the hot glue I just got on my finger. Make you stronger. I don't know if it's What similar. doesn't kill you makes you strong. Do you think we could get Kelly Clarkson on the show? Mm, that would be a bit of a stretch, but we can try. Can we like, call her agent live on the show? You We'd can. probably get sued. Would we? Ooh, this will work. What are your thoughts on Kelly Clarkson? What's your favorite Kelly Clarkson song? I honestly haven't listened to her music in so long. There's some shade coming from the control room about Kelly Clarkson. That I don't know. Everyone else in the control room is happy about Kelly Clarkson, except for our audio board operator. Oh, that smells amazing. Does but it? Yeah. You, it's going in for another four minutes, though. Daniel? Guess, of course Daniel doesn't know who Kelly Clarkson is. Of course, he Daniel. Doesn't. Let me call the control room. Okay, well, three, 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 three. I always forget. Is there another three, Shannon? Three, three. Yeah, there's four threes. Three, six, seven, three. Uh, I'm on hold at the control room. The hold music is Kelly Clarkson. And break away. Oh, that is a good one. Make a wish. Break some sticks. <laughs> I'm sorry, the control room is busy right now. They're not picking up. Anyway, um, so 1905 um, was the year what was invented. I thought you said 1945. No, 1905. What year? What, um, the hot glue gun? No. no. What are you talking about? I don't what do you, know. What was invented in 1905? I don't know. There. Probably something important that I can't think of. Popsicle sticks. Oh, that would make sense. What we're holding. Yep. Well. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long day, okay? My animation class today was mildly pointless. Oh, oh my God. 
What did you do today? My animation class. Mm -hmm. It was mildly pointless because we didn't do anything at all. So we just were there. Yeah, well, uh, I feel like that's every class I've ever taken. Uh. Ever. Kidding, kidding. Whenever the professors are watching, they're like, my class is, has points. And I'm like, not enough periods. <laughs> meals, not enough meals, am I all right, boys? Melissa, Melissa, are you more of a meal or more of a point girl? Oh, I was don't a, tell me that you live off campus. I was a point girl when I lived here. Yeah. I was all about those points. I switched to that all points plan as soon as I possibly could. I'm on which all points this semester. For any freshman watching, is your second semester on campus. So I highly recommend you switch. Especially because it's like the meals are ridiculous now, like 17 meals a week. I know, that's like a lot. Like, Michelle Obama is quaking. She does not want us to have that many meals. I'm sure. <laughs> wow, I love my new hair. Melissa, don't we look good? Oh, you look great. You. I love what you've done with yourself. Um, I went to Bang's Hair Salon. I got... I got beans, greens, potatoes, tomato, ham, yam, lamb. How much time do we have left in the hour? Did I, even, oh, I didn't even start oh, this. No. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't start the microwave. <laughs> It's been sitting there for like. <sighs> oh, Melissa, no! Oh, oh Melissa, oh no! Oh, I need to she's done go it. to bed. I Can don't I even clean get... out your ear with this? No, God, oh, Lordy, no. I have pretty. Ow, ow. Okay, that did not. Hurt. No, it did. That's pointy. I'm weak. I really am. Um, I just had a suggestion from the control room. Yes. That we do twenty four a twenty four hour cooking wave. <laughs> like like super dance, but like twenty four hours. I mean, if you're down, I'm down. I think I might actually cry. But like I would be into it. Oh my god, Melissa, we can make so many crafts. We can make crafts, we can make a lot of snacks. Could so my really second my third wall's going up. I have started making a more of a Doga, mm -hmm. I guess, is the way to put it. More of a what? A dojo? Like a little, I don't know, lantern maybe? I don't know. I'm free-forming it here. Understandable. Honestly, just let, expressionism is just all about it, you know? I do just you, love expressionism. Do you even know what expressionism is? I just is? love Chuck Close. Do you know Chuck Close? I think so. Oh I, don't, God. I haven't been thinking about art history since my midterm. I'm not going to lie. That's still. Apparently, Carl's gonna come in and judge whose craft is better, and I already have a sneaky feeling I know who's going to win. Because he would never betray his father like that. So. Um. <laughs> so. Like all this. Son. Carl. I'm actually Carl. like. This is, it's a little Carl, how could you do this to me? You're on the He didn't Carl. even come in and judge yet. How could you betray the fa How could you bring shame to tearing the family me apart, like Carl. Oh God, You're tearing so me here. apart. Carl. I feel like if Carl was my son, we'd be living in like the time of the Dust Bowl. The Great Depression? The Dust Bowl. Great Depression. The Dust Bowl. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm sorry. But I'm handling very hot pieces of glue here. I guess, whoop. Nope, we don't burn co-hosts. <laughs> Only with jokes, am I right? Zinga! Sorry, I think I just knocked something over. I just knocked over my Canada Dry. I'm sorry, wait, what? My Canada Dry. You actually have soda in here? Uh, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I got some. The soda. I got some. Soda. It's soda. Pop? Nope. Hey guys, sorry I look like a trash bag today, but that's what you gotta do. I haven't been able to do laundry. I refuse to do laundry with this polluted water, so that's all I have to say about that. Oh, that smells good. I can smell her. Yeah, I know. What scent is that? Not is Meg. that Katy Perry's new scent? Probably. Oh, I'm sorry, did I burn you? Um, I wish. <laughs> do anything to feel alive again. What are your thoughts that on Mulan? <laughs> really depressing. <laughs> Um, it's a good movie, but not racially accurate at all. Great Disney movie, not really 
Carol is currently singing Mulan into my earpiece right now. Oh, I wish I could hear that. It's okay. Yes, Carl. Yes, Carl. do my I bet we could get Mariah Carey. Go for it. You know what, Patrick? Did I'm we have her perform? I'm not going to stop you. Yeah, if you can get her. What? All I want for Christmas. Did you see they're turning that into like a Hallmark Channel original movie? Yeah, or something. She's getting like a movie out of it. It's like animated, I think. Oh, really? It looks not good. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Not as good as uh, Grandma Got Run Over by a Reindeer. Classic. Okay, so it's cooking more. Don't just Me too. Another four minutes. Patrick, are you trying to break my craft? Never. <gasps> Melissa, can I tape your nose? Why? Like, you know they, where people do that thing where, like... Yeah, but why? 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 <laughs> my nose is too big for this. I don't think it's going to work. I think we need stronger tape. <laughs> oh, Not gonna there work. we go. There it is. You, you look great. <laughs> you look good, kid. Oh. oh, my goodness. Well... Things are moving along quickly here on my craft. I'll be drinking out of this in no time. Uh, Melissa, I need the hot glue gun. There you go. You can what are you it. making? What is that? Um, well, it's supposed to be a house, but then I realized I would have used too many popsicle sticks, so it's going to be like a little pagoda, I guess. Interesting. It's a little lopsided, so maybe there was, I don't you know, know, like an earthquake or something. I know. Bleeding this, tower. I think, which foot up? is bigger? What, what's what? your bigger foot? You know how people have foot I foot bigger than I honestly other? don't think I have a bigger foot. I, I just have I small do. feet. Hold on. Yeah, your Oh, my left. left foot is bigger. Do you have... <laughs> I think it's so close. I like how you're wearing Burks and socks. It's a fashion statement, if I've ever seen one. I love fashion. It's my passion. It's really not, as you can tell. Uh, hashtag what he wore. Oh my god. The hole in the bottom of my Birkenstock. <laughs> Hello. It's raining out too. Like that's just, how does that, that's horrible. I can see you. <laughs> I'm Get your happy. foot down. Get your foot down. Put your hand down. You know when Judge Judy does that? I accidentally over. cracked my pelvis the other day. Like, no, nah, I didn't break it, but like, it like <laughs> it cracked. It was like very disheartening to happen. So that's about where I'm at. If anybody wants to, I should sell these to FSA. They should replace all their cups with these. They could really cut some cost. I'm trying to think of, like how advanced I want to go here. Mm -hmm. So, let's check in with the control room. What's the number again, Melissa? Three, 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 Oh, sorry, that was Virginia. Control room, hello. Hello, hello. Oh, hello, control room. Who is this? It's Patrick. Patrick. Hello. My grandson, Patrick? Yes, it's me. Who is that location. even talking? Your grandfather and I have been so worried, Pat. Have you been worried? What has been going on there? I heard the Dust Bowl has hit you pretty hard. What? The Dust Bowl. What? The Dust Bowl. The Dust Bowl. The Dust Bowl. Oh, what a time. I lost my brother and my cousin and my brother and my other brother. Oh, no. I'll have to hop in my Ford Fiesta and drive down there to visit you. Oh, Lord! Are you, why are you in the control room? Are you here? It's hard to live in the dust bowl. Oh, okay, no, Melissa. I didn't. I think you should try and be a little more considerate. No, I, I, I get it. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, I, I understand. I, under I, get it. I know the struggle. 
<laughs> you know the struggle of the Dust Bowl, Melissa. Yes. I'm sure some survivors would beg to differ, like me and my grandmother. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, sheets of paper. <laughs> so there's... Oh, we're really into these crafts. I'm going hard. I... So I've ran into a problem. Since I haven't been cutting this side, it's going to be hard to, like, put the next wall up. <laughs> so maybe I can just break them. Oh, there we go. The honors student Melissa coming out. Ingenuity here. Okay. Oh, I think our thing is done, Melissa. Yes, I'm going to check on that in a second. Let's check on our roof. I'm really invested in this craft. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, she's looking good. I think there's she four more minutes good. left, right? Yeah, oh. that sounds about right. So why don't we throw that back in the micro, and then yeah. we'll check in during the next break. Yeah. Or after the break. We'll see you on the other side, guys. Back in a minute. They'll test you. Try to break your will. But however loud the loudness gets, however many cheese puffs may fly, you're the driver, the one in control. Stand firm. Just wait. And move only when you hear the click that says they're buckled in for the drive. Never give up till they buckle up. fouls are pretty dumb but if you decide to drink and drive underage you could lose your license and your freedom underage drinking and driving the ultimate party foul guess what i have some news for you there's free food right there junk food you see that truck oh geez. it's a two michelin star chef all for free ladies and gentlemen all for free here we have a panzanella with summer vegetables and pesto Enjoy. How we doing? Fantastic. So what do you got going on underneath that plate there? This food is really about to be thrown away. Yeah. Really? Is there, is there something wrong with this food? Where did you get it from? From farmer's markets. They put aside the ugly vegetables and the ugly fruits. Carrot top, soft avocados. It was all food that was going to be discarded. Even the drink you had is made from like a little bruised peach. Did it taste a little it's bruised? Great. It was good. The average person throws away 24 pounds of food a month. That's a lot. Isn't that a lot? Go visit savethefood.com for more information. Thank you. Done, go done. But you are exactly what I'm looking for. Your company could be missing out on the candidates it needs most. Learn how to find, cultivate, and train a great pool of untapped talent at gradsoflife.org. I realized that I'm not perfect, but it all really started to change because you judge me for having a problem. No one is going to know that I need help. I need help. I know that no one is going to judge me for having a problem. I realize that I'm not perfect, but it all really started to change because you listen. I guess sometimes things just happen. Devastating things. It's got nothing to do with fairies. changes in an instant and you never see it coming that's what happened to me the day my mother had a stroke 
I'm Paul George, and I want you to learn the signs of a stroke fast. F-A-S-T. F. Face drooping. A. Arm weakness. S. Speech difficulty. T. Time to call 911. Because the sooner they get to the hospital, the sooner they'll get treatment. And that can make a remarkable difference in their recovery. Protect the ones you love. Spot a stroke. F-A-S-T. Fast. Guess what? I have some news for you. There's free food right there. Junk food. Do you see that truck? Oh, jeez. It's a two Michelin star chef. All for free, ladies and gentlemen. All for free. Here we have a panzanella with summer vegetables and pesto. Enjoy it. How we doing? So what do you got going on underneath that plate there? This food is really about to be thrown away. Yeah. Bro? Really? Is, there, is there something wrong with this food? Where did you get it from? From farmer's markets. They put aside the ugly vegetables and the ugly fruits. Yeah. Carrot top, soft avocados. It was all food that was going to be discarded. Even the drink you had is made from like a little bruised peach. Did it taste a little bruised? It was good. The average person throws away 24 pounds of food a month. That's a lot. Isn't that a lot? Go visit savethefood.com for more information. Thank you. Junk food time! Or just like. Hello, welcome back. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Welcome back. Uh, the dungeon. The dungeon. Well, this is done, uh, but it also needs to rest for five minutes. And I. She's done to I need to rest for five. Minutes. Once again, did not get up in there. <laughs> we're uh, in the. We need our Tatinko bag back. All right, Peachy. Peachy. Yeah. So um, we're gonna let this just like be open. Dan's getting oven mitts. Oh, we might also need spoons we or forks to try eating this forks. because, again, I was not... Oh, I always forget favorite. something. This wall's kind of concave, but it's fine. It's good. I built my house. Cute. I'm like, ah, oh, time to live in it. <laughs> oh, furnish it. Who knows? Maybe I'll use it for a stop motion. Use it for my animation class. It's not that bad. Ooh. Understandable. I would get that. I understand your struggle and like where you're coming from. I'm gonna do this. I'm sorry, I'm like all over you. It's fine. And then so here, my I don't know if we can get like a zoom on this right here. This right here. Can we go zoom on this right here? I'll go. I'll go. Um, so as you can see, like this wall um, is a little concave here, and I'm afraid if I, it's gonna snap. So I think I'm just gonna tape this, like little hole. So that's where I'm at. And then I just gotta put on the handle, and then we can drink out of it. I made this. I don't know. Got a little lopsided. Oh, you know what? I can I can fix the hole. I can but it's okay. That's Thank not you, an oven mitt. I'm not gonna use this as an oven mitt. I just feel like that's wrong to animals. Oh in my general. god, PETA's literally on the phone right now. The control room just asked if they could put PETA through. Yeah, go ahead, control. I think we're having a little trouble with the line. Let me go. It's really hard to do the YMCA with these little fingers. <laughs> oh, I should get this out of the oven. Can you I imagine being an orthodontist? That'd be stressful. I'm going to come around and get it out so I don't have to reach. <sighs> yeah, go ahead and put PETA through. Of course, thank you. PETA, I never knew her. No, I... Oh, it's not the organization PETA on the phone. It's PETA bread calling. Ooh. Good bread, good bread. Good carbs. <laughs> Uh, Melissa, they want to know what you'd like to stuff in their pocket of bread. Falafel. They have a lot of space, they said. Okay, yeah, no, I'm telling her. Wait, what do you want to put in I there? I said falafel. She wants to put in a falafel? They're delicious. I could make some. I have chickpeas at home. They're offended. How are they offended? Here, I'll put her on. <laughs> uh, how? No, I can't. She can't, she can't oh handle the pressure God. of talking to you. No. Not today. He, his father built. Well, I'm sorry, sir. What's your name? All we need is this is like done. Hanson. <laughs> it pops. 
pants and feet of bread the same. <laughs> I will put respect on your name, sir. I'm sorry that we offended you. To the dungeon! <laughs> ooh -wee. There she is. There's a ghoul in the dungeon. <laughs> There's a troll in the dungeon, Patrick. <laughs> Who's in the dungeon? So this is what it looks like. <laughs> is it done? Yeah. Oh, we got to drain that water mill, so that's That's disgusting. not water. That's butter and apple butter. juice. That's supposed to stay there. But we don't have any <laughs> spoons. Are we done? Yeah, but we don't have any spoons Carl's to eat it with. Carl's going to be in just so a minute. Gonna... So I just got to make it work with this uh, handle real quick. Just I'm going to just give me a hot fan it a little bit because it's hot. Got to make it work. Miss, can you just hold this in place for me? Thank you. Oh, thank you. I'm just making my handle. Let me just take a few, few seconds here. Okay. I'll just, oh, God. Why didn't you make the square part before and then attach it? You might get a little, okay. Yeah, there we go. Right here. Okay. Great. Why don't you just make it a triangle? I am. Ah. Oh, no. Sorry. You hurt me every time. <laughs> Oh, that was so, ah! Oh my god, the hot glue's everywhere! Uh, so, oh no, a good idea, thank you. There you go, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. It's like a support. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we can go ahead and send Carl in. You're crushing it. Huh? This is dead air right now. It's unreal. There she is. <laughs> this is dead air. Oh, she's done. She's oh, I never hung up on Peta. I gotta go, Peta. Bye. Do we have spoons to eat this or no? I don't think so. Don't think hey, so. Carl. Hey, Carl. Hi, What's going on? Okay, so let's start with Melissa's. Um, nice. Do you want to like maybe like you know? I just want you to like kind of feel it. Just tell me about the rigidity of it. How you're feeling? I don't like those words. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's making me uncomfortable. Well, I'm sorry. I'm feeling something towards rigidity. Oh good, 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 good. Not bad. Very, very. Not bad. Do you want to like maybe Thank drop you. it on the floor? Please don't drop it on the floor. Should we do a drop test? I spent time on that. I spent time on mine too. Yeah. I might actually use that for art later down. This is not horrible. Later down where? Later down the road. <laughs> Yeah, I'm done. I'm just putting on a finishing touch. How's your day, Carl? It's all right. That's good. No. Happy for you. How's class been? Which one? All, all of, of them. them. <laughs> uh, they're all right. I like them. That's good. good. What's your major again? Video production? Yeah. yeah. A good one. Are you done yet, Pat? Oh, I'm done. I was just adding a little flair. Just... Okay, here's the... Oh. <laughs> Very nice. Hold on, let me just... Here you go. <laughs> um, so like, you can like hold this and drink out of it. So I don't know if you just want to like. That's fucking hard. Use my hands. Um, can we get a zoom in on that? Yeah, there we go, right here. Um, I just think that, are you understanding the vision of where I was going with this? What? Why don't you enlighten me? Um, so I was just kind of like reflecting on my life and my time in math and action. And like these sharp dagger like um, little like wood spears are kind of like what math does to me. And so this was like my math, this reminded me of like my math professor. And then over here is like my resilience with these more like longer, like, you know, well put together ones now that I don't have to take math. This anymore. makes my major feel like a joke. And then um, I put a nice solid foundation because I feel like I have a solid foundation. It's gonna have an existential so. crisis over here, kids. Well. Here, should we try it? Can I use the rest of that, Melissa? Mine? Why? Because I want to put some liquid in here. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, the lemon juice? Oh, yeah, I want to see. Here, it's, it's oh, on. Oh, 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 gosh. Okay. All right, let's put some LJ in here. While he's doing that, could we get, it. like, spoons or forks, please? Because. Oh, that all just. Oh, <laughs> hooray. It and worked towel. Out so good. I love it. I love my mug. You see, Carl agrees. Oh, you, Carl. <laughs> wow, I love that I can drink so much liquid out of this. You're gonna get that all over there at <laughs> night. That's disgusting. <laughs> so who wins, Carl? Well, I have I have a ribbon. A ribbon that our director Daniel made. Oh, Dan, you're Number so good. One, is that R backwards on it? That's his craft. Okay. Obviously, not an English major. Clearly. Um, 
I'm gonna. Uh, I, I'll give this one to uh, Patrick here. Thank you, Thank Carl. You. Oh, I love when my son um, gives me awards. <laughs> perfect place. Perfect place for that. Just down there. Yeah. Okay. Down there. Good. Uh, I have another one that I'm gonna give to Melissa. <laughs> number one dad award. But she's not your father. <laughs> my son. I'm so proud of you. You've done so well. You have brought shame to this family. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. Dad, let me put, put, put my grandmother through. Hello. Loki, want to like. <laughs> Hello. Have you heard the news? Is Carl there? Yes. Is apparently, he's no longer my son. He said. What's that? He's not my son. No, not Carl. I know. Well, how could he do this to me? Listen to your grandmother on the phone. Oh, your grandmother. Listen to your grandmother. I don't know how we can you eat this. Shame. Get out. Go. Get out. Oh, my sweet. Come back with spoons, please. And get some spoons. Whoa. Spoons. Oh. Let's get some spoons. Okay, Grandma, I'll call you back later. Or I guess we can. Do you want to use a spoon or a fork? Um, all of the above, actually. I think this is how it's supposed to be. It's like very watery. Well, that's just because of all the liquid in it. This is hot. Go for it. I mean, yeah, it's not bad. I think you're right about draining it. I think that would be yeah, better. Yeah, we should probably drain her. But on that note, we're going to go. Yeah. Have a good it's night. Thanks for watching. Good night. Bye. Bye. Next week. No, two weeks. Two weeks from now. What are we doing next week? I don't know. All right, we'll figure it out. See ya. <laughs> and that's a wrap. Oh, God. Should I even try draining it? <laughs>